So this is one of the very first things in regards to history of bands topics that I've covered involving a musician's health. And um, I will be doing this as a regular sort of series, uh, telling you, just so you're informed, if you don't already know, because we are history of bands and we do cover musicians, so obviously if they die, uh, then it's natural to report on that uh, in the best respectful way I can. Um, so not too long after his wife's passed away, it's been confirmed by a source, Guardian and the family, that Peach Boy Brian Wilson, the last surviving Beach Boy brother, has got dementia. It's it's sad, it is, especially when you take into account of all the things he's been through. In his life. Just to end up. Getting out. You know Alzheimer's slash dementia. Now. It wouldn't be as bad. And I say this. In a respectful way. It wouldn't be as bad. If there were two. Beach Boy brothers by his side. Carl and Dennis. But as we all know. They passed away years ago. And only Brian is the last brother standing. The last Two remaining original members of the Beach Boys, well, three at the moment, is Brian, Mike and Al. But as we all know, that could change. Due to the dementia diagnosis, it's understandable that he'll deteriorate and eventually he will die. We all know that, let's be realistic. And if that's the case, then it's an end of an era. Brian is... Such a talented musician. Such a a fantastic writer. That it's unbelievable. That he could fall under a terrible illness. I'm not saying that this is. Great to exploit. But Brian doesn't deserve this. He doesn't deserve to. To be beaten at the hands of a deadly memory loss killer it basically is memory loss killer and it's going to take the life as it does with a lot of people of a brilliant writer and a man who could in a few weeks time not forget what he's done and just think about that now i'm sad about this because this is the first time a very well-known musician has been diagnosed with something like that. And this has come from a very obvious point and stand. Like I say, Dennis Wilson died in 1983 and Carl Wilson died in 1998. Dennis died of drowning, Carl died of cancer. But to Brian to get dementia, it, it it's pretty sad. Brian doesn't, like I say, does not deserve this at all. He certainly doesn't deserve any of this. In a way, I just expected him to surpass for years. But he is 82 this year and he has lived a good life. Full of very good terms of service to music. He inducted the Bee Gees in 1997. And he was present when the Beach Boys were inducted in 1988. I was just going to let you all know in this video, if you don't know, of the dementia.